What's up guys, my name is Marcel from One Dapper Street. Welcome to today's video, which is another episode of the Getting Dressed series. For those of you that have been following me for a really long time, you know that those were my bread and butter, basically just showing you step by step how I put an outfit together. And today, I'm going thrift shopping. So for that shopping experience, I wanna show you how I get dressed so you guys know a couple of things, pointers for what outfit to wear when you're going shopping. Let's get started. And we're starting with these jeans from Goodfellow, the brand at Target. They're really nice and slim and why I'm going for these jeans is for one, they're nice and comfortable. I can get in and out really quickly because if you're shopping for pants, that's a big thing. And secondly, I can pull them down a little bit and try them out with some more baggier styles. But if I want to shop for something a little bit more dapper, I can also pull it up where they're supposed to be and then see what that would look like. So it's a really nice, neutral, versatile piece that I can try several things out with. Next up, I recently bought this Comme des Garçons play gray long sleeve at Saks like the last week and I've been loving it and I'm wearing it right now for very similar reasons. It's a simple gray shirt. It's kind of like a little bit more relaxed but if I need it to be it's also nice and tapered if I were to tuck that in right now for example. Just like this. It works. It's great. It's neutral but overall we're starting to have a very basic and versatile outfit that is still stylish enough because I don't know Maybe you're like me, when I go shopping, I kind of want to look the part so people don't feel like they need to actually help me. They're like, oh, he looks good. Let's leave him alone. That's kind of my strategy here. But we'll get more into that with the next few pieces. Be right back. So now we got some socks, white socks. Before we talk about them, let me put on the shoes that go with it. The Adidas Supercord is what I want to wear today. Honestly, out of the simple reason that I can slip into these so easily. Boom, and done. <laughs> If tying shoelaces was a little bit easier, or I was better at it, then I'd be even faster at this. Boom, and done. So why these Adidas Supercord? One, they're comfortable. I'm gonna be walking around a whole lot, so you wanna be wearing sneakers. You can super easily get in and out of them. Once again, super helpful when it comes to trying clothes on. And lastly, they're a white sneaker. They're not the most versatile. I'd say something a little bit more classic, like a little bit more slim, would be even a little bit more appropriate if you're trying on something more dapper, but definitely, Versatile enough for me to go shopping and thrifting today. Now, I'm in New York City now, and I just came here from LA, so I am not used to the cold. So we gotta layer up a little bit, but I've got just an idea of what I wanna do that I think is gonna help you guys too. A nice double-breasted overcoat from Canali in this case, but the idea here is that you wear a nice statement piece like this beautiful coat up top. It's gonna keep you warm. It's just one layer you have to take off, so once you head into the store, there's actually not all that much that is keeping you warm. You can easily just put the coat down and not overheat because that's what happens to me a lot when I go shopping in New York, especially when it's cold out. You layer up, you bundle up, you have heat tech on, I don't know, you go into the store and you just start sweating your balls off. That's not great. So the look that we've got so far, really nice, really simple. The white sneakers are kind of getting picked back up in the lighter color of the pattern of the coat, as you can see right here. So that's how the shoes work. Usually I don't wear just like a white shoe, especially not with the white socks if I don't pick it up somewhere else. Now lastly, let's add a few accessories. Cold weather accessories, we got a gray knit scarf, then we got a little bit lighter gray beanie. And a beanie is another thing that I think is gonna come in really handy. Right now I don't have that many hairs, as you can tell, or at least they're not long, but when I was shopping and I had long hair, I felt like I was try on three, four different sweaters that were a little bit tighter. My hair would be messed up and then I'd be looking into, my, into the mirror and just think everything that I try on would look ridiculously bad because everything was messed up. So I actually like going shopping with a beanie. It one, prevents your ears from getting cold, which is what a beanie does. But two, you can actually just, when you try on an outfit, pop the beanie back on, something neutral like this doesn't really take it any certain way. And then you don't have to look at your messed up hair if you're as special about that type of thing as I am. I'm hoping that helps you. Then we've got a couple accessories. I got two rings because I lost this one on the flight here. Then we've got two more rings here. My Piaget watch. And that is the look altogether. So if you're wondering what this now looks like in a little bit more motion, I've got you covered. We got the cinematic coming in three, two, one. And I hope you guys enjoyed that. Thank you so much for watching today. 
Make sure that you subscribe because what I was talking about, the thrifting thing, that's another video we shot today as well. So there's going to be a Come Thrift With Me episode one really, really soon. I think there's some really dope pieces. I hope that today this gave you a little bit of inspiration and maybe some help when you're trying to figure out what you're gonna wear when you're going shopping when it's freezing outside. So thank you guys so much for watching. Leave comments down below if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Otherwise, I'll see you guys very soon with the next one. Until then, stay dapper. Bye guys.